Hi Spark, how are you? I hope you've had another good week. Um, so this week uh, is a little bit different. I'm not going to discuss one of the questions from the book. I mean, not from the book. One of the questions from the bucket, the question suggestion bucket. This week I've been thinking about a song which I quite like. It's called Stupid Deep. And it kind of paints a picture of somebody longing for God, I think, anyway. I'm not really sure. I'm not sure if the writer, the singer, is a Christian. It's not really a Christian song. It's just a pop song. But the lyrics kind of talk to me about somebody who's looking for God. So I thought I'd just sort of share it with you and share some thoughts. So it starts off by saying... What if who I hoped to be was always me? And the love I fought to feel was always free. What if all the things I've done were just attempts at earning love? Because the hole inside my heart is stupid deep. Stupid deep. What if where... I've tried to go was always here and the path I've tried to cut was always clear. Why has life become a plan to put some money in my hand when the love I really need is stupid cheap, stupid cheap. So to me, this song is somebody saying, why Well, to me, it says, why would you search for love and search for happiness and try to just get money and all this stuff when the love you really need is always there for you? God's always there for you. The first lyric is something about what if who I hoped to be was always me. And that talks to me about the fact that God made you who you are. You're the person God made you to be. doesn't mean that sometimes you're not going to have to try hard to become better or try hard to break bad habits. It's not an excuse to be lazy, but the person you are is who God made you to be. Never forget that. And then this part... All the, what if all the things I've done were just attempts at earning love when the love I really need is stupid cheap? Sometimes in your life you try to be someone that everybody will like. You try to do things to sort of earn love or make the people you care about love you. And life shouldn't really be like that. Life sh should be doing your best and doing the right thing but always knowing that the love you really need is right there because God loves you. In the, there's this saying that I tried to look up and it's a bit hard to track down because it's very old. Um, but there, there's this saying that there's a God-shaped hole in everybody. And that's kind of, the same idea that this song is talking about. There's a there's a space for God inside every person's soul. And some people try to fill it with all kinds of other things in the world, but only God will fill it. That's why we're all looking for something. Oh, why did my screen just disappear? Oh, goodness sake. Um and then there's lots of lots of verses in the Bible which talk about the fact that God made you who you are and you are the person God made you to be. You just have to be you, the best you you can be. So there's that, the sort of one that we use a, yacht, a lot. Did I just say yacht? There's the, what, the verse that is used a lot that says, um, for the, the for God knows the plans he has for you for I know the plans I have for you says the Lord 
lens for a for hope in a future and plans to prosper you. So that's sort of talking about the way God's made you and what he's made you for. He has a plan for your life. And there's references to you being fearfully and wonderfully made. God made you. God doesn't make mistakes. And God loves you. And that's really what I wanted to take you to take away from this today. This little... Uh, look into the song which has been in my head this week anyway i hope you've enjoyed your weekend if you're going back to school or back to school work anyway good luck try your best do well and i'll talk to you guys soon